Thank you for watching my channel please subscribe and like. Now back to the news. Kathy and Rick Hilton's go to date spot is surprisingly low key. We go to the Cheesecake Factory once a week. The Real Housewives of Beverly Hills alum, 64, exclusively told Page Six from her Bel Air mansion while promoting her new Smirnoff Ice Smash Tea campaign. He really likes the chicken, fettuccine Alfredo. And then also the one that you dip with the sauce, she said of her spouse's go to dishes, noting that all their food is good. As for Kathy, she prefers to order the meatloaf while dining at the popular chain restaurant, which has multiple locations in Los Angeles where the Hiltons reside. Where else can you get meatloaf? asked the mother of four, who shares children Paris, 42, Nikki, 40, Baron, 34, and Conrad, 29, with real estate tycoon Rick, 68. Kathy noted that she didn't indulge in any of the eateries famed cheesecakes last time she and Rick stopped by, though she appreciates their many dessert offerings. Most of all, however, she and Rick, who tied the knot in November 1979, are fans of the Cheesecake Factory's busy atmosphere. It's local, it's right there and fresh and busy all the time, the Paris in love matriarch raved. Actually, you walk in there and there are people. We love that. We don't want to sit in a restaurant with nobody in the room. Kathy said the Cheesecake Factory is the one LA establishment where patrons are plentiful and spirits are high, as she feels a drowsy ambience has loomed over Hollywood and its bordering neighborhoods at the start of 2024. The energy's not the same. Last week, Rick and I, we went to the Cheesecake Factory. We left at 8.30 and the streets are dead, she said. I just kind of want to get back into the groove. But Kathy isn't waiting on the City of Angels to wake up. She recently invigorated herself by performing in Smash Tea Party, a Smirnoff Ice musical, the commercial for the company's line of spiked beverages that features glossy, Broadway-worthy production value. I had a blast. It was so much fun, the actress-turned-reality star enthused. It was like working on a movie.